hi guys welcome back to our channel thank you so much for clicking if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe to this channel uh hit the notification button so that you can be notified every time we upload a video and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for retaining so today i feel excited you know there's just something about saturday that makes me feel so 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 excited and so i'm feeling so excited today by the way my husband is not home so i'll record alone i've got five things that i want to share with you that i really believe will be inspirational to someone somebody out there so stay tuned and watch the video up to the end so the first one is resist the tendency to live an isolated life it's not good to live an isolated life moreover life is short be happy you know interact with people hmm? um we meet a lot of people in life we talk to a lot of people but not everyone should be our friend hmm? love them but don't don't make them so close to you you know some people don't really deserve to be in our lives they bring negative energy hmm? am i talking to someone so we meet a lot of people talk to a lot of people but it's very important to have only few friends if possible pick only four or five people to be your friends if you pick those check up on them talk to them interact call them chat you know, it's good to communicate. It's good to have friends that will be in your life and you in their lives also. People that, you know, friends that can bear your burdens because a friend should be a burden bearer. But some, some people we call our friends don't really deserve to be called our friends and they can't either bear our burdens. So it's very good and healthy for you to have only few friends. Mm? after all we're all sinners people are people people will always be people mm? so that was my first one second get over those who disappoint you people will disappoint you no matter what some people will disappoint you for no good reason people will break their promises People will break your heart and will not care about how, how bad you feel. Hmm? Some people will just walk out of your life for no good reason. But you know what? Let them walk. Hmm? Number three. Some people are disloyal. And some simply let you down. Some people will let you down. Hmm? Those people that walk out of your life, those people that let you down, let them be. If someone decides to walk out of your life, let them walk. Life is short. Don't allow anyone to steal your joy. Don't allow anyone to, to, to drain your energy. You know, it's good to live a happy life. Moreover, life is short. Hmm? Number three. Lift up and encourage those who have failed. Lift up those that are trying to recover from failure. It's very good. Treat people with grace. Hmm? It's very good to treat people with grace. And you'll see a hand of God in your life. People, I tell you, God is good. And if you treat people, his people, with grace, he will, he will surprise you. He'll do marvelous things for you. Hmm? Number four. Let the Lord handle your critics. Stop going to the internet to see what it says about you. The best thing you can do to your critics is to ignore them and give them to the Lord. Handle them over to the Lord. He's able to handle the critics of your life. He's able to do good things. God is full of surprises. And the good thing about God is that he doesn't break his promises. All you need to do is trust him and stay faithful to him. He's a good, a miracle-waking God. 
Hmm? Number five, stay fully focused on the Lord Jesus Christ. Hmm? Stay fully focused on the Lord Jesus Christ because he's the only one that will, that will love you for who you are. He's the only one that will give you true love. God is good. Seek his kingdom, then all the rest will be added unto you. You know, if you trust in God and you love God, you believe in him, everything else will just flow. There is um, this song some kids sang some time back. Um, it goes like, Seeking first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And all these things shall be added unto you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So you seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Then all the things shall be added unto you. Thank you so much for watching. Those are the only things I had to share with you today. They are only about five. And I hope you really enjoyed them. Until next time. Bye-bye.